So it's clear that Gemini Carp Tackle have got solid bag fishing sussed. In the last two videos, we took a look at the Gemini Tidy stems, both the standard version and also those designed with the tubing kit. Today, we're going to be taking a look at the fluorocarbon solid bag leaders, and these feature the double ring swivel for fishing a drop-off lead inside your solid bag. So let's crack on with showing you how to use them. So as you can see, there's three in the packet, and the first job is to take them out and unravel them. Pop that aside. Just unravel those. There they are. Take one of those. Now you can see the fluorocarbon leaders are foot long. It's constructed from 100% fluorocarbon, 45 pound braking strength. So it's really, really robust. And you've got a special fused loop at each end, which is going to be stronger than any sort of knot that you can tie. Then at this bottom end, you've got the double ring swivel, one attached to the loop, and the second for attaching your hook link. So let's crack on with setting them up. As you can see, they're a little bit twizzling wire at the moment, but if you just run that over a bit of steam, that'll steam right out. Right, so there you go, you've got the solid bag leader, and the first step is to take a tail rubber, any old tail rubber will do. The first step is just to slide that with a gated latch needle down onto the fluorocarbon leader. You can then take your lead, pop the swivel into the front, slide the fluorocarbon around the outside, and pop the tail rubber over the end. So that creates your drop-off inline lead for use in your solid bag. It's now simply a case, like with all the others, is to attach your hook link. You make sure that you attach that to the second loop rather than the one that's attached to the leader itself, giving your rig a bit more freedom of movement. Just got that going on there with a the loop-to-loop -loop style setup. So there you go. All you need to do then is just attach your hook bait and make up your solid bag. And as you can see, what will happen is when you get the bite, the fish will pick that up, hook themselves, that will pop the lead out of there, and then your lead can simply pop straight off the leader. Right, so I'm quickly just going to floss on the hook bait. So I'm using a little ring swivel there, I'm going to put a bit of popped up corn on it, and that will balance nicely on that big hook. Slide that down over the little swivel, blob it off with the lighter, and I'm ready to go. So let's crack on with tying up the solid bag. So as you can see here, I've got my little solid bag bucket. I've got a nice little mix of pellets in there, mostly small ones. So the first job is just to just open up the solid bag itself. And without hooking yourself, gently lower the hook bait into the bottom of the bag, trying to get it to just lay flat on the bottom. And get a little layer of pellets on top. And use that to help just push the hook bait and hook into position. There you go, that looks about right. Fill in a bit more pellet. About halfway up the bag where you want to be. Give the hook link a gentle pull just to straighten out that hook link so it's not all hanging around where the actual hook is. Position the lead in the centre of the bag. Fill up the rest with pellets. Now you want to give it a good bash, squeezing it down from the top. Make sure you're getting all the air out of it. Get it nice and compact. Working all those little tiny pellets into all the crevices. The great thing about the tidy stems is that you can just wrap the top around. But where this is actually made on a tail rubber, I'm just gonna take a little bit of PVA tape, unravel it and just wrap it down, tightening around the bag each time you go. Gently bite it off and tie just a little granny knot in the top. Put my eye out. There you go. So in a simpler case, trimming it all down just to make it nice and neat. Carefully cut down the PVA, making sure not to cut the fluorocarbon leader. You wouldn't want that. This just makes it all nice and neat so it flies perfectly through the air. Then on the bottom, poke those corners back in, give it a lick pull it across and stick it, same on the other side, just again just makes all that bit more aerodynamic. There you go, perfect solid bag with the Gemini fluorocarbon solid bag leader. So for more information on these fluorocarbon solid bag leaders or any more of the great solid bag products from Gemini Carp Tackle, head over to their website geminicarptackle.com.